love bugs is Ross. I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored, and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing, beautiful, extended family, thank you so much for the beautiful vibes. Just joining in each and every day, dropping comments, and just sending beautiful vibes towards me as I do towards you. And I'm very grateful for those things. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. If you've been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, drop me a line or two. I love to get a chance to know you as much as you're getting to know me, or even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of the video, or you're just opening up to tell me about your empathic gift and tell me how it affected you or impact your life. Or if you feel like the videos gave you, you know, peace into your life or just good vibes and you would just like to share it with somebody else, go ahead and pass it along to a friend or give me a thumbs up or just plain share on any social media that you want with, of your liking. <laughs> and thank you so much for stopping by my channel today and I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And the music that I'm listening to today, which was very much needed for me. It is 471 hertz of spiritual detox, remove toxins and negative thoughts, and Mandela meditation music. And I will post that link in the description box below. And the video that I'm doing today, Twin Flame 101, Hey Oka's Breaking Chains with Negativity. And it was just like, you know, when we were going through so many things in life, it just felt like we were tied down. It felt like we were stuck and we didn't find our ways out. But it's like each and every one of us have been awakening almost every day and you're knowing and you're growing and it's just like you're breaking those chains that was meant to hold you down with all that negativity and you're like you know what I'm not gonna deal with this anymore I'm gonna find a way to you know to get myself stuck out of this because some people are comfortable being broken or feeling like they're broken you know you didn't feel that way you know, you didn't want to be a victim. I know I didn't want to be a victim of anything I went through. I didn't want nobody feeling sorry for me or felt like I needed a pity party. I wanted to know how can I break free from the madness that I went through? How can I break free from the negative energy that keeps dragging me down? Making my videos, thinking positive, even though we can't think positive every single minute because we're human. You know, there's days that we're going to have bad days. There's days we're going to have awesome days. And there's days you're just going to be like, eh, okay. <laughs> but it's just the fact is that you are willing to look at a different perspective in a different light. To know that there is light at the end of this tunnel. You know, you're you're stepping out of your comfort zone. You're, you're retracting and thinking things through without impulses. You know, we do that a lot. And, um... You know, even if they are impulses, it's just like if you know if you're doing a positive thing, go ahead. You know, it's just more and more we need that in the world today. It's just we have so many diversities. It's, it's so much segregation and so much just, just hatred out in the world where we need to go out there and, you know, pray for one another, love one another, you know, play it forward. You know, when you can help somebody out, you help them out, help them out. If you're able to, you know, be that person that a person just needs to talk to, you know, you really don't have to do too much. You know, I just love the fact that I can get emails every day or be able to sit down and talk to somebody and let them know, you know, what you're facing. You're not facing this alone. You know, once I'm able to, you know, just do those things, I reach out to people that I feel that need to, you know, know that they're, they're they're not going crazy. They don't, you know, you go to a therapist, just make sure it's a spiritual therapist. Because if you go to a doctor with the stuff that you got going on, you probably be in asylum and I won't hear from you anymore. So it's just, you know, we we go through many things and it we have to go through things to get to things. You you know, for things to be falling apart, they have to fall apart to be 
back in place. You know, we have to lose our minds to find it sometimes. And it's just, you, you're breaking those chains. You're making positive impact in others' lives as well as your own. You know, you're looking for better days and knowing there are better days. Um, you're just, I, I know what myself, it's just even though I might have a little residue that I'm still dealing with, I know that there are better days coming. I know that, you know, when I can reach out to somebody, I get more views. I have more people opening up to me that usually, you know, they probably won't open up. But I know if I can feel like I can be that voice to let you know you are stronger than you can ever realize. You are smarter than you ever realize. We are capable of doing things that we were like, oh my gosh, it's too hard to do. Now you're just like, you know what? You enjoy that challenge. You know you want that change in your life. You know you need that change in your life. So you allow the things that you need to do to come into fusion. So it's just like when you're able to break those chains, get away from those chains, knowing that you are able to take them off. And there's times that, you know, we feel stuck. And it's like I've said before, there's time there's so much negativity and there could be so much things going on in your life you can feel a prisoner to it but long as you know when you are in that cell there's always a key on the outside of that door or it might be the door is part way cracked you know i've had dreams to where you know when i felt like i was down in a wreck and i was like oh my gosh i feel trapped i feel stuck and i had that chain around my ankle but the lock wasn't locked i was able to take that lock off so I broke those chains, even though I might have, you know, I might have down days, but I have more up days than I do have downs. So when you, you can appreciate the things that really messed you up in your life, and you can appreciate all the, the pain and the sorrows and stuff that you, you have been through, knowing that it has brought you into a positive place. You may not understand the road that you're going on. You may not understand exactly where it's leading you to. But you know it's something promising. You know, you have to look at the signs around you. Look at the things that are going on. You know, you might have dreams that you're working towards. You might even have visions of the things that, you know, you want in life. You might say, oh, I want this brand new car and I'm saving up for it. And next thing you know, it could be a certain car that you're looking for. And all of a sudden you might see it on a billboard or you might see it pass by you you know, in traffic, or you might even see it on a commercial or even, you know, during the videos, you, we, we see car commercials all the time, or you might be wanting a dream house. And next thing you know, you could be watching TV and you see somebody moving into a house or all those things. And it's just, you know, you're working towards something positive in your life. You know, when you see somebody that's going through something and you have that voice that you can stand up for them when they don't have that voice for themselves, you don't know how just for you standing up for that person can allow them to gain that voice, that voice of confidence and saying, you know what? I thought I was alone in this world, but we truly aren't. Even though we might feel that way at times, there's always spirit guides. There's always people praying for us. It's just so many things that's coming good for our lives that we can't sit up here and dwell off the bat. So keep breaking those chains. Allow those chains to fall off and kick that lock to the side and know that you will not be chained down to the problems and the issues and the worries and the sorrows that you were before. Break that new ground. Step out your comfort zone knowing there are better days that are coming, knowing is so much positivity that you're pushing out trust me you're gonna get that back so be mindful of the things that you put out be mindful of your your thought process and the things that you you say out your, your mouth and speak the positivity into your life and claim and receive your blessings and pay it for it so I hope you are able to get something out of this video. Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And I would love the chance to hear from you. So drop me a line or two. And, you know, stay blessed and highly favored. Knowing that you are blessed and highly favored. And knowing there is always somebody praying for your better days. Send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. When you're able to, you know, when you have a blessing, you know, bless somebody else. You never know what you know how they might perceive that so i hope you have a blessed day stay stay blessed and stay safe and i'll see you on my next video peace and be wild